Welcome to a new vlog. Brain brought me a coffee before he left and I'm just sitting here like thinking about the day and like how exciting it's gonna be and I thought I would pick up the camera and start vlogging like right here. Haven't brushed my teeth, haven't done anything to my hair. I need to like seriously wash my hair and just get ready for the day. So I thought we could do that together. Brain is out early for his bachelor's and i think they're at the golf course just starting the day like that and that normally starts a little bit earlier and i have no idea what they are going to be doing but he said he'll send me some pictures throughout so traditionally you obviously like spend the day apart and the night as well so i booked a beautiful house for us but that is basically it like i don't know anything else i know what i need to bring what i need to pack but i don't know the theme i don't know what my friends have in store for me i've also kind of roped in zeta from 360 link she's also doing the decor and the coordination for the wedding so i thought it was perfect that she's a part of the bachelorette as well i know she has three other events today she has a wedding and i think she has another event and then mine so i'm just so happy that she could squeeze me in and i'm excited to see what um her and my friends have in store for me like i literally don't know anything mine doesn't start until a little bit later later in the afternoon so i'm just kind of relaxing and just enjoying the morning i um wanted to film a little bit around like getting ready and just wanted to allow myself some extra time so that i'm not stressed and yeah, I'm gonna, of course, bring you these along for everything. I'm gonna enjoy my coffee and then we can make the bed and get ready together for my bachelorette. <laughs> my new Dyson Coral straightener and I've been wanting to try one of these for the longest time like since I got my first Dyson Airwrap and now with this upgrade that I shared with you recently getting this is just oh I'm so excited but it's nothing it's like nothing I've, I've used before all of my straighteners are just like plug in turn on this one has like a little bit of a charging port and then it's completely wireless or like cordless so i'm really excited to try this i literally just used i just brought this for my tiktok so that i can like put it in my tiktok i just used the blow dryer attachment and the round brush attachment just to kind of like sleek out my hair um but i think i'm gonna make something to eat now because i'm sure today's gonna involve a little bit of alcohol so i just want to get some nutrition in my body before we do that we were bad to all of you if you only really like literally three hours <laughs> or like getting ready like six hours before 
the actual event starts or the actual day starts but i wanted to get ready like early so that i can film some content i did some Kara stars i did my dyson unboxing i want to get a cute little photo before i leave and I also have to record something for Bryn for his bachelors that they will use tonight. It's like a little Q&A. He also, like as far as I know, he also did that for me. Um, because last night he was like, go to the room, I need to record. And I just helped him. So I'm assuming like it's the same thing. So yeah, I'm really excited about that. But I think because I have like literally, I'm going to say I have two hours. Like just in case I have two hours, I don't have three hours. Because sometimes I just get carried away. And then because I'm filming like in between, you just sometimes things just take a little bit longer so i think i'm gonna finish my sandwich and my coffee and then i'm gonna pack i think i'm gonna pack everything that i want to take with and then like get the car ready and then i'm gonna do my makeup and then get dressed and then i'll film the little video and then we can go to my bachelor there is no way you can beat them my partners in crime Dogs in every flying bullet They are filling up the air Couldn't catch us there now, could you? Dogs in every flying bullet Can't prepare yourself for us There is nothing to disguise honeymoon clothes in the hallway but i'm done with my makeup i'm so excited to finish my look with you i quickly wanted to sit down and film this because i need to be done in an hour and i still need to film this and edit so i thought i would do that quickly and then i just want to finish my look take a couple of pictures and videos and then we can head off to my bachelorette but the questions are questions like what's the groom favorite ice cream most prized position favorite sports team we all know the answer is arsenal the dream vacation of the groom shoe size like questions that you can play a nice little game around so i'm gonna sit down and film this quickly just chipped a nail closing up my suitcase but we are getting dressed i actually didn't have an outfit until five o'clock yesterday because i ordered a bunch of dresses and they didn't arrive in time like they're supposed to arrive this weekend i was hoping they would arrive before but anyways estelle fisser she's doing one of my wedding dresses the last dress she actually i went for a fitting yesterday and she said I could wear this. Don't you see, baby? A girl's gotta take a flight. Every once in a while. Leave no girl behind. See my girls and I. A girl's gotta do what a girl. Gotta do, gotta do what a girl. <sighs> I'm actually sweating. Is this what it feels like? On the day of your wedding because you are then i need to get ready 12 hours before <laughs>
but smile Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on I put my feet up And we just sing along And I can't help but feeling Just loving this moment Can we stay here? look look how cute they've literally just put my pajamas out my little slippers oh this is just so cute and look who i'm sharing a room with hello <laughs> my friends and i will talk like every other day shaking the funk where all the boys are riding skateboards they look so hot they look so cool everyone is around See him in school and now he walked up right to me And my knees got weak and I just had to leave He was weird, I'm so shy <laughs>
Hello my ladies. Oh my goodness, we've had the best time so far. Been dancing, a little bit tipsy, but we're having fun. I took a nice shower and I feel a little bit sober. <laughs> but yeah, it's just been like the best day ever. We changed into our PJs now, everyone else also changed. And we are gonna enjoy the last bit of the evening together. Oh. Pop the bubbly, she's getting a hobby. sitting here because I wanted to like unbox all of them with you I know I tried to kind of vlog in the moment and like show you the gifts like as I was unboxing them but yeah the day was just I think I did the best I could <laughs> to bring you along um but I just I must say before I open all of these things like my friends and my family they are just incredible like incredible 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 the day was every even better than i imagined it to be and it was a very emotional day but also a very fun day like i had 
the best time I was dancing like I don't really consume like much alcohol but we had shots and we like we literally just had innocent girly fun well not all of it was that innocent um i'm not gonna show it to you again but they got me this glass you know what <laughs> and that was just like the funniest thing but i mean i feel like all bachelorettes that i kind of you know come across or like seen pictures of it it gets a little bit naughty and it got a little bit naughty <laughs> towards like the end of the evening with that um like whip gift <laughs> but it was so funny and this is something that i couldn't actually open on the day and that i can't actually open until seven days before the wedding because it's an advent calendar so i thought we could like open like the the big box and see what it looks like inside because i i didn't open it so i wanted to open it like with you um but we're not going to open the gift because we'll, we'll do that in the wedding prep vlog i'm working on a wedding prep vlog like everything leading up to the wedding featuring my little bride slippers so this is from my friend nadine So it basically just says that it's almost our big day and she is very excited to celebrate with us. She says that it's an advent calendar for the last week leading up to the wedding um, and everything is like numbered. to open this with you thank you Nadine absolutely oh my friends are just so incredibly special like you have no idea like everyone was just so thoughtful they get, can we just talk about the fact that they gave me three themes like when I was asked like what I would like I was just like I would like everyone to dress up and just like have a fun day with me. I'm wrapping this up again because <laughs> I'm going to unwrap it again. So I was like, I really just want everyone to dress up. And I liked, I saw, um, sorry, my hair is so dirty. I need to wash it. Um, I really liked the something blue. Um, but I also liked, ugh, there was, I'm so, such a Barbie girl and such a girly girl. And I really liked the pajamas and Prosecco. Like, I liked so many things. I literally couldn't choose. And I just said to my friends, you know what? Just, like, I don't know what I want. Just, like, it just surprised me. All I want is people to dress up. And they dressed up. Like, they had two, like, two outfits for most people. And then all of my friends that stayed over had a third outfit. Everyone ordered matching black pajamas from Adore Couture with their names on it and everything. And that was just so special to me because as you know, all of our guests are going to be wearing black. So that was just like the perfect little detail touch for me. And just the house, like the house in general was just so stunning. I booked that. I looked at so many different places and found this house in Randburg, like so close to our house. And it wasn't a far drive for everyone. It was relatively close for most people. And we could stay over. Like the decor was just so stunning i just loved like the neutral vibes with the pop of plants and the rooms were stunning and they decorated it so beautifully it was just like it was perfect 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 and then i got all of these stunning gifts i got so many like underwear so much underwear so much lingerie so many beautiful pieces this was from my sister-in-law she got me this little um what do you call it maroon like deepish plum red this is from temptations bridal i think it's from bras and things actually how pretty 
so pretty and then she got me a little candle and a voucher as well all of the girls that stayed over got me two gifts like they got me like a candle or something like that and then like a little naughty gift and then this scent is camellia blossom i had to guess the gifts i had two guesses oh this smells so good i had two guesses if i guessed it wrong the first time i could guess again if i guessed it right they took a shot like the person that i guessed and then if i got it wrong the second time i had to take a shot so i got this one right on the second guess because i just i know my sister-in-law so well and then i think this was also one that i guessed right brain's aunt because she's bought something like this for me before like i i am a very detailed person so i remember things and this is one thing that i remembered i also got like little candles like this is like a diffuser set and candle another diffuser and these two were actually given to me at my last like my previous appointment at nutrition reset for like my cellulite treatments and circulation treatments so she sent me home with this and a beautiful little card that says mr and mrs awesome so i was asked what i wanted like what do i want what don't i want and i just said you know what i we have everything for the house so just please nothing for the house because we don't want to be sitting with 10 cheese graters <laughs> This was like a funny gift. It was so funny. A cheese grater. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> and then this was a really sentimental one. It was the first gift that I got. And it was actually from my mom. We were all just crying <laughs> so much. So all of my beautiful friends had this made for me from my mom. And it's just so special. It says, to my daughter, though others won't see me, you'll feel me by your side. Keeping you steady down the aisle will stride. You'll feel my kiss on your cheek as I give you away. For know that I am next to you on your wedding day. When you have your first dance as a wife, Leave me an empty chair and you'll see me beaming ear to ear. As I'm sitting there, for I couldn't imagine you having this day without me being a, a part because I'm the one that loved you first. Right from the very start, I love you, Mom. This was just so sweet. And then a picture of my mummy and I. <sighs> and then this one was also very special. A little drawing of my mom and I in this really pretty frame. It's like a floating frame. I feel like I don't... <laughs> I didn't expect my friends to be this sentimental and like to pull on my heartstrings so much but I am just like like these things are just priceless like obviously they cost money and I'm very very thankful for everyone that came and that spent money on me but just like the thoughtfulness is just like oh, gets me every time okay so and Brain's mom my future mother-in-law she gifted me and everyone at the bridal shower a like wine experience so we had like a wine connoisseur there and we had like a wine tasting and everything and it was just so special so that was her gift to us and to me i'm gonna take out all of the um like lingerie because i want to show you um but if i open like one 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 at a time it's obviously going to take me like forever just want to make sure everything is out okay so 
So I have a couple of really, really beautiful ones. A little card. I like read every single card as I opened the gift and just like really absorbed the moment and really put thought into my guess like who it really could be from. Okay, so lingerie. Got a lot of it. <laughs> Got some really beautiful pieces. Brain is going to be very excited. <laughs> so pretty. And then another black one. How stunning. With like a little matching black and white lace panty. A little red moment. Apparently someone told... One of my friends asked Brain what his favorite color was, and he said red because obviously Arsenal. <laughs> and so many people got me red. So I was like, why is everyone getting me red? But it's obviously because it's his favorite color. And then we have more panties, <laughs> more lace. This is like a, this is really nice. This is like a five pack, I think, with different colors. And then it has like a little bra and another color. Sorry, I'm showing this so quickly. I just don't want to sit here forever and show you all of these like really fine, beautiful details. And it's underwear. It's kind of intimate and personal, but I feel like us ladies know each other, so that's okay. And then another little, I love dresses like this. It's like you're kind of showing but not really like it's really pretty and then this one i also really loved it's kind of giving me victoria's secret vibes with the stripes i hope you get to see nicely so pretty this is really nice i love that and then another little naughty thong moment this i loved this karishma got me and she like I feel like she knows me really, really well. Everyone knows me well. But this, I think, like, out of everything, no, I can't say. I love the red one my sister-in-law also got me. And I love some of these black ones. Oh, I don't know, but I'm such a neutral girl. So I think this is why this is kind of, um, all of a sudden I'm so hot. <laughs> this is why this is catching my eye because of the color and this detailing here and the, the like satiny silky material. It's so pretty and it's from Woolies. It's so cute. I love that. I love everything like honestly. I love everything. Oh and this was also from Karishma. A little H&M moment. Love it. I have the darker one of this. And this is the sun-dried linen. It smells so nice. And I love the big size. Oh, a charger. <laughs> my charger. I found my charger. <laughs> and more underwear. So someone had asked Brain. Um, this was um, like one of our family friends. Asked Brain what my favorite underwear was. And it's like this. Um, seamless material so she got me like a little pack of that um, I had one more pair but Karishma forgot to pack underwear so I gave her a pair of my underwear and then you saw this little t-shirt so stinking cute so so many of our friends and family when they try and say brain and Jace really quickly they always say brace <laughs> and her husband actually says brace all the time so she did a little shirt for me that says brace on the front and then at the back it says i hashtag i duplicy and i wanted to give a special shout out to one of my ladies i think her name was tracy she actually commented this hashtag on one of our old videos like one of my old wedding related bridal vlogs and when i saw it i was like yes that is our hashtag like why didn't i think of that i duplicy instead of the du it's i do so i love that and that is like our official hashtag for the wedding so they had this um like printed on the back Oh, another pair a little white one and i can smell this candle from a mile away 
and one of my favorite brands of candles woodwick so this is the island coconut oh my goodness i can't wait to burn this oh i love it it smells incredible these woodwick candles like same with the yankee candles so you don't even have to open them or like lit like turn them on with the fire <laughs> you can literally just open them and you can like smell it from a mile away literally so much underwear stunning oh and more lingerie from adore couture i love these little silk sleep slip dresses i have been wanting a fresh one so now i have a fresh one for the wedding night i've slept in these so many times they're so comfortable you can put shorts on underneath but they're just so comfortable it feels like butter on the skin so i'm gonna get this one cleaned up and then a little mrs duplicy eye sleeping mask with some gray silver mrs duplicy slippers love that and then a little scrunchie and then i think this is the last lingerie set this is from bras and things i think krishma also got this for me so cute i think because we have the same body type she knows exactly like i love these little high waisted shorts and then just this barbie pink is so pretty it has this little detailing here it's so so stunning okay i think that's everything for lingerie and so many gift cards i need to make sure oh the card fell out i need to make sure that i check all of these bags all of the gift cards so i don't lose them but a little candle and there was a gift card in here and then um a gift card and then a letter from brain so it was from my friend but um at the back it's a letter that brain wrote to me with his favorite photo of us I'm going to try and translate it. It's obviously in Afrikaans. So it says, um, my leaf, it's obviously my love. The day that I get to call you my wife can't come fast enough. Um, you are the gift from God that I'll forever be thankful for. Your smile is the highlight of my every day. To love you is... Um, what is voorrag in Engels? A privilege. <laughs> your love for your closest is an inspiration and your beauty just a bonus. Your motivation and um, dividing. What is dividing? Motivation and determination in everything that you do uh, make me want to be a better person. Um, in life where we can only experience a handful of firsts, I'm very thankful that I get to experience so many with you and I'm so excited for so many firsts with you by my side. Thank you for your love, your support, and just for being you forever and always. I love you. I tried, I tried. <laughs> and then this is the very last one. I love the blue and pink and just like the attention to detail because obviously everyone wore blue the first part of the day and then the second part the pink. So yeah, I love this and how cute is this card? It says bridal shower, congratulations bride to be and obviously last but not least the best gift of all the gift of presents the gift of just like being with me on this very special day like the one day that i'm only gonna have once in my life um and then obviously like the wedding day just like the gift of friendship the gift of love and like the gift of like intangible presence and like yeah something that you can't really like put into a beautiful box something that just showing up and just being there just 
like genuinely to each and every one of you, everyone that's just so the support and like the time because I can imagine how much time and effort all of this was like behind the scenes and just also a big thank you to Zita from 360 link for the most beautiful setup like she worked so closely with all of my friends and my friends told me like afterwards she would message them and send pictures like which plates do you like and which um like which of what do you like should i do this one should i do? and they were just so involved with her as well and i just wanted to thank her as well and thank you ladies for watching i think actually i know this is a really long vlog but i know <laughs> <laughs> you like these long vlogs i um told you that i didn't have anything to wear up until like the day before the bridal shower because i ordered a couple of things and it arrived a day after <laughs> the bridal shower so i thought i would show that to you regardless i ordered a couple of things so let's open that up and then i can pack all of this away let me pack all of this away first and then we can open that what is love? What is love? I don't understand Wake me up, wake me up, yeah Reaching for your hand Everything is nice and tidy again. I'm like balancing you on a candle. Is it gonna work? Is it not gonna work? Are you slipping? I feel like you're slipping. Okay, so I obviously ordered these things thinking that it would arrive for my bridal shower and like bachelorette weekend, but it literally rocked up like a day after. <laughs> like the Monday um, after my bridal shower this box came or this packet and I yeah I was like a little bit disappointed but I it, I feel like it's still nice to have these things it's still it's things that I can wear on the honeymoon um, except for this because I obviously thought I would use this on <laughs> the weekend of my bachelorette so it's like let me just show you it's like a bride-to-be set with balloons, um, streamers, um, a bunch of different things. So I'm actually going to keep this because we have a couple of weddings in this year. Like our friends are getting married like one month after each other we have like two or three weddings so and then we have a bunch of friends that are engaged so i feel like i can use this for one of them at some point so i'm gonna keep this i'm gonna use it and yeah it's gonna be really really fun because it says bride to be so i feel like it's silver and although i didn't have that i still had my bride to be because i told my friends i was like i ordered something with my dresses that you, you can use for the day and um they ordered the exact same thing they just they could only find it in pink but i feel like the pink matched absolutely perfectly it just popped so beautifully in that room so i love that so I got that and then, oh, I also got this. I wore this um, like a couple of days ago. It's just like a um, pearl headband. It has like the different size pearls. I think it's so beautiful. Um, this balloon set was a hundred rand, by the way. It, it is a 62 piece. So if you are a bride-to-be, I feel like Shein really is like an affordable one-stop shop to get so many things this was also like 80 or 90 rand love it so i am excited to wear this many more times so i have that and then oh i just need to look at my order because i ordered so many things um i wanted a little charm for my 
um, Nano Speedy. I've seen these photos everywhere. Um, Nano Speedy with pearl chain. I think that's what it's called. Um, I've literally seen it like everywhere. This is the picture. So it's literally like a little pearl bangle, not a bangle, a strap. And I thought I would put this on my Nano Speedy. I think it's so cute. Like, look how cute. This is on a different bag, but it's so cute. Um, I love it. I feel like you can put it on almost every single bag. I'm trying to look for... Oh, this is the nice Nano or the niece Nano. Um, I just, I feel like it's so cute. It's so cute. And the quality isn't too bad. This was like literally 50 Rand. <laughs> it was so affordable. I'm not going to use it as a strap. It'll just be a little accent that kind of hangs from the bag like that. Like, so cute. Oh, I feel like it's a little bit too big. What do you think? I don't know. Maybe this will be perfect with a Speedy 28 or a Speedy 50. I don't know if Brain can maybe take out two or three pulls for me and just like shorten it a little bit. I'll maybe ask him. But let me know what you think. I'm so excited that I finally have that. I've been thinking about it for a while. Like I've seen these like Pinterest, Instagram-y pictures with the pearl. And I just think it's so cute. And then for the second look, uh, my friends told me to bring like a Barbie pool style look. Like poolside look. So whatever I wore was literally, I thought about that outfit um, as I was packing the morning of i had no idea what i was gonna wear i didn't know that what they were gonna do so i had like and i didn't know if the pool was gonna be heated or not but it was freezing <laughs> it was so cold and um i was just like okay i'll do like a one piece and then i just packed a skirt and like a little um like sh shoulder thingy and originally but originally i wanted to do this I'm going to show you a picture of it. I'll put it like here so you can see it properly. It's just like a little crossover top with the um, bikini shorts. Please excuse the washing machine. And then this stunning skirt. But I'm not mad at all. I feel like I had fun in my little outfit. Um, and I feel like I looked fine. Um, I just, yeah, I wish I had like a cuter outfit for my second look so um yeah although i'm sad about it i definitely don't think that this will go to waste i feel like i'll wear it in marseille when we're like in saint tropez like poolside kind of like poolside not that we're gonna do like a pool honeymoon or like a beach vacation honeymoon but i feel like we are gonna have days where we are just gonna be like beachside chilling by the water and maybe like yeah i'm just gonna pack a couple of bikinis so i like that i have this set with the skirt and everything and then um i was thinking of wearing this dress but like i said i'm so happy i don't know if it's this one i think it's this one i'm happy with the dress that i wore so happy that i wore that dress it's like a one of a kind it's so stunning but i also love this I won't be able to try this on for you right now, but you will see it on the honeymoon because I definitely think that this is something. I'm going to pop a picture. It's this dress over here. I'll pop it big so you can see it. It's like one of those like scarfy dresses that goes like to the one side and then loops around the neck. And this feels incredible quality. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, this was $13. I always keep it in dollars because I feel like I don't know how much it is. Then I'll just... <laughs> if it's in Rand and it says like four or 500 Rand, I'm like, oh, 
I can probably just buy something like that in South Africa because you have to make customs on top of everything. So uh, $14 in Rand is $2.50. So I feel like $2.50 for this dress really isn't bad at all. And I literally cannot wait to wear this on like an evening night out on our honeymoon very excited about that i also wanted this for either my um like pool look or you know something fun um but i also feel like i could potentially try and see if i can use this on the wedding day because i really wanted gloves for like a um champagne tower shot so i wanted to have some made but then I was like, let me just see what these ones look like. These were literally, let me just see the price for you. These were, trying to find the glove. Um, these were literally a dollar. <laughs> so like 20 bucks, not even. And I feel like they're so cute, but I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see. I like that it's kind of... I don't know i don't know i feel like it would have been really cute on the bachelorette but it's too late now we'll keep it regardless we'll use it for something oh my gosh it has a ring it has a ring i'm definitely taking that off something blue how cute but that's a little bit tacky don't like that at all so taking that off so cute like literally like a little blue Dud ring just took that off seamlessly very nice and then this was also like my barbie um not that i know i didn't know it was going to be a barbie but like a poolside look because i feel like this is pretty poolside but i wasn't sure but this will definitely be used on some occasion during the honeymoon it's such a pretty dress i love this like tassily bit i'm gonna put like a big picture for you over here this was also like 250 not bad at all and i feel like the quality is really good um i would have liked this in a longer version but i feel like it's quite fun with the short as well and then lastly i got two more things um i got i don't know i, I didn't get this specifically for the honeymoon i just wanted this top because i felt like it was so beautiful it's not even white it's like an off-white this color says doesn't say a color it just says apricot what is, what is apricot probably like ivory i just loved the style of this top so this with jeans or yeah like trousers i feel like it's such a pretty a pretty staple and pretty basic and then lastly, I got this skirt a while ago. Actually, it wasn't with this order. I just got it as I was organizing and like, you know, reorganizing my wardrobe. I found this. I was like, oh my gosh, I got this for the honeymoon and I forgot about it. So it's just like a skirt and I love the little tassels. So I'm picturing this with like a nice little top or a t-shirt some sandals some sneakers and i love the texture it's like it has these little flowers on it and the quality looks incredible i got a size medium so i'm hoping that that's gonna fit so pretty i love the detail and the texture and the tassel <laughs> But that's it from me, Leafies. I really hope that you enjoyed this vlog coming along. I really loved bringing you along on everything and just so appreciative of my friends and like my family. And like looking back and editing this video, I just 
everything was just so perfect and the way everything was just captured and the fact that my friends like literally recorded everything for me because they know how important it is for me and the fact that they recorded like this way for youtube as well we appreciate you we see you i even saw like my friend marina going on the floor at a time <laughs> trying to get my reaction of me going into the room and that's just like priceless like i appreciate like all of the love and all of the effort and i feel like this was a really good like practice round for the wedding day vlog because obviously like on the wedding day it's gonna be a lot like it's gonna be a lot i'm gonna try my best to vlog um i did book a on the day wedding content creator with um Breitritt. i'm so excited that they are gonna help me with that so that i can get as much content for you as possible both for youtube i'm gonna give her a camera and my phone as well so that we can just get as much as possible so that i can share the whole thing with you so i'm doing that i'm also working on a little wedding prep vlog so yeah just in advance thank you for being so patient with me the past couple of weeks with the vlogs coming out a little bit slowly and i think it's going to come out even slower leading up to the wedding and then after with the honeymoon and everything but just know that I am vlogging, I am bringing you along. The whole editing just takes a lot of time and sometimes I'm not able to do all of it like straight away. But I'm really excited to bring you along and eventually get it up for you. I hope you ladies enjoyed this vlog. I love you so, so, so much. I'm excited for what's to come, like the wedding prep, like everything leading up to the wedding and then the wedding vlog and then the honeymoon and then everything that follows as being a wife and just like building our life together, this new chapter and whatever follows after that. I'm so excited to bring you along. I love you Leafies so, so, so much and I will see you again very, very soon. Mwah. Bye Leafies.